Yo, right. YouTubers, welcome to Pit My Road. Today we're customizing a 2009 Ford Cougar. Oh, got vinyls and everything. It's gonna start my screen recorder. <laughs> All right, sorry about that, YouTubers. <laughs> All right, so here is our car after episode three. Um, you know, we put all the colors on it and everything, just like as you know. And this is what I've been practicing on. That is what we're going to be making today, Gimpers. It looks a little hard, but we can do it. Don't worry. Actually, not sure if it looks hard. It, 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 it um, it's pretty easy. It's, it's pretty good. Okay, so I'm just going to drag over my toolbox and let's start. All right, so I've put stock images on my website. So um, we should have no worries. Um, you know, you'll have no worries getting the vinyls. All right. So the first thing we're going to do is this black top here. So that's pretty easy. All we need to do is just go. To, well, let's duplicate the orange layer, our body orange layer, and we're going to zoom into oh two hundred percent. Yeah, that'll do. Get a, your selection by path tool. Click on the, um, just, you know, make a path. You, you guys probably know how to do this by now. Okay, so once you've done that, press enter to convert to a selection. And go edit, or oh, hang on, select, invert, edit, cut. I think that's it, yep. Select none. I'm just gonna hide the orange layer for a sec. And that's what we got. So now what we're gonna do is go to colors, colorify. It's the same color as in the body kits tutorial. So it's Oh well we'll do this one first. Eight nine eight nine eight nine is the first color. And the second color is just the same as last time. 7A, 7A, 7A. That's a bit darker than the first number. The first number. Okay. So that looks pretty cool. Just going to zoom out. That looks pretty cool as it is. All right. Just put the color back on. All right. So there's our black top. I think it looks pretty cool. Alright, so let's chuck on the first vinyl. Uh, let's do number two first. Vinyl number two, that's the main the main vinyl. Alright, so once you've just dragged it on, hit alpha, add alpha channel if it doesn't have one, and let's flip it. Press your uh, select by color tool, and hit the white and cut the white. Select none. Now let's go to our scale tool and let's pull it around and jerk it a few times. See what we can come up with. Yeah, it's alright. Press the alpha to selection on that layer and we'll do this gradient. Black to 434343. Four, three. And I'm on radial. Okay, hang on. All right, brilliant. Select none. All right, so let's chuck in the second one now. Number one. And this is the dragon layer. Add an alpha channel, and do the same thing as last time. Just get rid of the white. Select none, and let's scale it. Make sure the chain isn't broken on your scale dialog. Okay, enter. Now I have done this dragon so many times, I wanted to give it a color and everything, just like on the Fast and Furious 1 cars. Um, I've tried a lot, but um, it's pretty hard for well for me anyway. Um, you guys can do whatever you want with, with your dragon, but if you can't think of anything, try this. Just do a black, 
the black to white um, FGBG colors. Alpha to select the dragon. I might duplicate it just for a template, um, just in case I need it in the future. Go to your uh, gradient tool and go to radial. Let's see how that goes. And that is the wrong way around. Okay, that's pretty cool. Select none. Uh, yeah, alright. I was hoping to keep the head a bit more black, but that'll do. Alright, so once that's done, we can do our third and fourth layers, which, um, are sort of ghosted into the, sort of ghosted into the paint, as you can see here. Alright. Let's go number three next. Number one became number three. Aha, uh -huh, right at the front. Add an alpha channel. Get rid of the white. Select none. Actually, alpha to select and fill it in with white. Now let's scale it back. This one's going over to the front. Remember, you don't have to do this. You can customize your car however you want. But if you can't think of anything, just you can follow along. I mean, hey, that's what the tutorials are there for. Alright, so once you've done that, go to Layer Mode Overlay. And that ghosts it into the paint, which looks awesome. And number four now. So just drag that over. Add an alpha channel. I'm just going to check in where we put this. Oh, beauty. Okay. So once you've added an alpha channel, go to your uh, select by color tool and get rid of the white. Select invert. Fill with white. Select none. I'm just going to move it over here. In this one, with the with the scaling process, I actually had the, ch the chain unbroken because I like it. Um, I'm gonna fold it up a bit more, like like you know, like that. Folds up in the corner there, and that looks pretty cool, like more square than rectangular. I think it looks better anyway. And now I'm going to go sight into the paint. Brilliant. Okay, so that is my side of the vinyls. Let's just see how we're doing in time. Okay. So thank you for watching YouTube. Um, this has been a Nuthawk Mini Kim tutorial. The next one will be tires and then rims. So thank you and goodbye.